Hey everybody, I'm back with another update of what's happening here in Southern Utah and today I'm back out here in Fort Pierce Industrial Park on the south side of St. George. This area is one of the big economic drivers of all of Southern Utah as it has a ton of different businesses, both big and small. Uh, there's a lot going on in the works right now. I did my best to get everything I could, but if I missed something, I apologize uh, as there is so much going on out here. I uh, really look forward to showing you everything, so let's get started. First up, we'll start right here at the Silver Reef Brewery that's been here for some time. Uh, they just opened one of the coolest new restaurants in town called the Silver Reef Craft and Kitchen. Not only is the food amazing, but they've created a, a super cool atmosphere with some of these tanks inside with, uh, that are brewing, uh, along with some TVs, a bar, and like I said, really good food. I know it's already been a huge hit the last couple weeks since opening, so if you haven't checked it out yet, definitely make sure to come out here. Now from here, we'll just head down the street to Kangaroo Storage Facility that has uh, pretty much finished construction but is not open yet. I uh, don't have a set time frame on when it'll be open, but should be sometime soon. Then just down from there, we've got Whitaker Construction that's just about finished with their building as well. They do everything from irrigation and natural gas, san uh, sanitary sewer. Uh, so their building should be wrapped up here pretty soon and they're set to, then they'll be set to move in. Uh, just around the corner from there, we've got a couple uh, other buildings in the works. The first one we'll come to is Built Trailers, which is a high-end boat uh, trailer manufacturer. Their building is just about finished as well, and then they'll be set to move in. Uh, then just down the road from there, we've got Great Western Supply. This building is also just finishing up. Uh, no set time frame just yet on its completion, but should be done here pretty soon as well. Then just a few doors down from there, we've got Crate Space that recently opened just a few months ago. Uh, they receive, store, deliver, and install furniture and accessories for interior designers here locally. Uh, so they are just a, a place where people can store their stuff and then they'll also uh, ship it out for them. Uh, they, like I said, just opened up recently, uh, so make sure to check them out. Now we'll wrap back around and head back south down River Road and just on the other side of River Road, across from Utah Food Bank, we've got Penske Trucks that's about to go under construction. Uh, they're gonna be right here on the corner of River Road and Venture Drive. Uh, no super set time frame just yet on construction, uh, but should be starting any time now. Then just right behind it, we've got the big Sun Pro footprint that includes a yard and their building. Uh, their building is currently under construction still, and I don't have a set time frame just yet. Uh, but they, Sun Pro supplies building materials and supplies to contractors throughout Southern Utah. I know they're really excited to get this thing done. Then just a little bit further south from here, we've got the Family Dollar Distribution Center that's been here for a long time. Uh, they recently just purchased 17 more acres and plan to expand another 400,000 square feet. So this will be a huge addition to their footprint and I don't have a set time frame just yet on when that will start, uh, but it should be sometime in the near future. And lastly, we'll cross back over to the western side of River Road where we've got all this new land, uh, new lots that are in the works. Uh, phase eight is done. They've got 28 lots. Uh, they've got everything from small lots to big ones that will accommodate a 200,000 square foot building. Uh, don't have anything said just yet on what's going vertical and when, uh, but should have some more info on that here pretty soon. Then next to it, we've got phase nine, uh, which is another 50 acres. Uh, that's gonna be done uh, right around the uh, end of March is when they plan on having the lots ready to be sold. So this is another huge area for Fort Pierce Industrial Park to continue bringing new uh, businesses out here for years to come. And I'm really looking forward to seeing what comes. And lastly, I do wanna briefly mention the road that's going to parallel River Road uh, along the Fort Pierce Wash that's gonna bring a new parkway along with a new park. Uh, this is going to be th where 3000 East uh, currently ends in Little Valley, uh, is going to go all the way through the wash and out to southern, the Southern Parkway, uh, Highway 7 as Exit 5. So it's going to be called Southern Hills Parkway. It's going to open up new uh, areas of development, both residentially and commercially. And then it's also going to bring a reservoir and a park uh, that will be able to be a storage facility for the reservoir, as well as a new park for people out in this area. I uh, don't have a set time frame just yet on that, but it is currently in the planning stages. Hoping to have some more info soon. And that's a wrap, guys. As you can see, a lot of good stuff happening with businesses out here in, in Fort Pierce Industrial Park. Really looking forward to seeing it continue to grow. For more info on what's happening here in Southern Utah, you can call me or text me 435-668-7293 or find me on Facebook, LinkedIn, or Instagram. Thanks, guys.